Good evening, Southeast Texas. Over at Orange, you can see the instability in the atmosphere prior to that line of thunderstorms. Look at the thunderstorms, or at least the cumulus clouds building up, and then heavy rainfall fell briefly over in Orange. Currently 68 over at the Horseman's Western Store in Orange with a northwest wind, and we're seeing that front move on off to the east. Notice the low clouds now moving in from the northwest. That could be an issue for tomorrow's forecast as far as afternoon high temperatures. Anywhere between one to just over two inches fell in uh, southeast Texas over in Port Arthur. MJ Pontegraw reporting uh, 69 at the station there. It's 68. Uh, as you can see, temperatures in the mid to upper 60s in our local area. Otherwise, 50s College Station, Austin, San Antonio, Tyler, and then you go on into the 40s and even 35 over towards Amarillo. And that's roughly about 20 to 25 degrees, almost 30 degrees cooler than 24 hours ago as this front continues to push on off to the east. A dry northerly flow continues to push on down into the state, courtesy of high pressure. Otherwise, in the tropics, watching an area disturbed weather in the northwest Caribbean, probably going to be a depression over the next day or two. A good chance, high chance of this happening. And the next name is Zeta. Uh, two camps right now. It looks like uh, it will head on off towards the north, be picked up by a front, and hopefully turned off to the north and east. We'll be watching this very closely. Otherwise, future cast showing partly to mostly cloudy skies tonight. I expect temperatures to fall into the upper 50s to lower 60s lakes, lower to middle 60s in the triangle. So a cool start to the day. And again, Tomorrow's high temperatures will be, be dictated by how much sun we see tomorrow afternoon. So we'll go with the low to mid 70s in southeast Texas for your highs. Had to drop that a little bit. On the Gulf of Mexico tomorrow, slightly choppy seas around 1 to 3 feet in your coastal marine forecast. We'll see north winds at 10 to 15. Our forecast tonight, partly to mostly cloudy, certainly turning cooler with lows near 60 in the lakes to the low to mid 60s in the triangle. Then tomorrow, clouds in the morning, sun in the afternoon, highs low to mid 70s. Extended forecast. Well, near or slightly below normal temperatures for a change. Well, you don't hear that very often on Saturday. Sunday, southeast winds return, and that means that we will see an increasing amount of moisture across our area. You'll feel it coming up Monday, and Tuesday's a real headache. We're going to be watching a front stall anywhere between the lakes and the triangle. If you're north of that, you'll see certainly cooler temperatures than what I have there. South of it here in the triangle, uh, it looks like temperatures in the uh, lower 80s. Then. Uh, pretty good chance of rain and thunderstorms coming up Wednesday afternoon and evening as the front finally decides to push through and then fall arrives coming up Thursday and Friday. Share your pics and video with 12 News. Just go to the Near Me tab inside the 12 News Now app and click Share With Us.